you guys want to hear that? Just his vocals. Let's just hear his vocal during that part. I think that would be cool to check out. <laughs> Hey everybody, it's Nathan Walters, music producer, recording artist, and former boy band member. Back in the early 2000s, I was in a boy band called Plus One on Atlantic Records. So fun. All right, I'm going to be reacting, but also kind of doing something a little different today. I'll explain. If you clicked on this, you know that I'm, I'm going to be reacting to um, Jungkook's Hate You song. We're going to be watching the uh, official uh, visualizer, which I haven't seen. Uh, what I did is I downloaded it off of YouTube and I pulled it into Logic. This is a, this is an audio program that I used to uh, produce out of. And you can see I also went and I took the audio file. I went to this one website called Fader.com. And uh, you can put the fo the song in there, the audio file, and it will like stem out all the different, I don't know how it does it, like magic. It will stem out all the different uh, audio files that it can. These are all the, the audio files separated, like the drums and the guitars and the bass and the vocals. So that way, as the song goes on today, I can like stop and go, oh, let me, let me hear that part. I want to see what that part's like. Uh, that's just gonna be fun for me. I hope it's fun for you. I I know this song. I'm I'm already familiar with "Hate You." I I listened to the whole record, um, uh, John Cook's record when it came out. I stream streamed it like once or twice, so I'm still getting to know it. But um, I I do like this song. Uh, I did see in the credits that Sean Mendez co-wrote this with some other guys, and so that's kind of cool. Yeah, let's let's dive in. I got my I got my tea. Link in the description if you know me. It's my favorite tea in the world. It's made of roses. You should check it out. I drink it all the time. Let's uh, pull it up here. Let's dive in. I wish you went. First off, uh, yeah, okay. I really love that that piano sounds so old and in mono here let, let's 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 look in at the audio file i mean it's, it's playing by itself that's what everybody hears but it's in mono if you know me i'm always talking about stereo left and right um here it sounds like a nice it's like it's old it's in the background it's so nostalgic feeling anyway i love that okay uh, the reason I want to say that is because uh, as a producer, it sometimes it's tempting to go, oh, we got to put the best new sounds here. Um, uh, sometimes it's cool to do old sounds or, or, or not so good, high quality sounds first in the track because it allows the track to kind of get better and better as things go. And I know that's what, that's what happens in this track, but I also love the sound of that. Okay, here we go. I wish you Okay, I want to say a, a few things. I love, um, first of all, I can relate to this this lyric. It's like if you've if you've gone through heartbreak, um, it's an, you know, you def definitely felt this way. Where you try to make up bad things about the person when there's nothing bad to make up about them. Uh, anyway, so um, I do love this this whole vibe of this song in in the lyric in that verse. But I want to say the piano part. Uh, started it's like. It came alive a little bit, and you can see in the audio file there's an extra piano that happened. Check this out. Here, I'm just going to mute the piano by itself. Originally, it was like this. That's in mono. It's very quiet. And then there's another piano added on top. It's cool. Just It's in stereo. It gets a little fuller. You hear the attack of the piano happening i love that okay so i just want to mention that but let's get back to the video his performance of vocals sounds so great actually you guys want to hear that just his vocals let's just hear his vocal during that part i think that would be cool to check out i wish you went by my back and told me lies and stuff like that sounds good i wish you kissed cool all right, let's go. Let's hear all the music. I wish you kissed someone I know and did that run. Forgive a ball. Maybe hating you's the only way it doesn't hurt. So I'm gonna hate yeah. you. Yeah. 
those vocals sound so great coming in. Okay, okay. I got, I got, I'm so tempted. I got to hear those vocals by themselves. Here we go. Right. So I'm going to hate you. I'm going to hate you. Pay you like the feeling that you never were. Let's bring the vocal, the track in. I'm going to blame you for things that you don't do. Cool. cool those vocals sound so great and you know what's great about this track is like you, you can see it here vocals bass piano that's it and there's a lot of vocals so that, that, you know let, if as we muted them i can hear or not muted them as we solo them <laughs> you hear so I'm gonna hate it, it's a bunch of it's a lot of vocals that are stacked but it is just the melody so i'm gonna hate you and also oh, i'm gonna hate you that's the only two notes there's no other harmonies and I and I and I love that like it, it could be tempting as a producer and a singer to go well let's add some more harmonies in there you know but the more harmonies you add in there sometimes it c the the track can appear to sound smaller and so when there's a low uh, when there's an octave where it's it's the note I'm gonna hate you and then um, the same note but an octave higher I'm gonna uh, Oh, and he's not that. Oh, oh yeah. I'm gonna hate. I'm gonna. Hey, okay, that's it. That's the octave. Um, it creates this really open, open feeling, which is a nice little trick that I use a lot as well in my productions. But um, I love that reverb. I mean, listen. That reverb from hurt, hurt is still trailing over when he comes back in. It's so it's so lush. Let's check it out. We weren't perfect, but we came close Until I put all of our pain under the microscope And I still can face it I'm still in love for what it's worth BTS and the solo guys, all of their, all of their music videos are epic But this, this feels literally like a, a photo shoot, you know? But look at this shot right here, this is so cool it literally feels like, yeah, like a nostalgic. But oh, I rewound it too much. Here, let me get back up here. Like a photo shoot. Cool. And I still can face it. I'm still in love with what it's worth. Maybe hating you's the only way it doesn't hurt. So I'm gonna hate. In the bass, oh, cool, nice. I was gonna say, and now the bass comes in, and I love how the the video changed color like that. Here, let me. I wanna see what that bass sounds like by itself. When the AI separates these tracks, sometimes it always it doesn't do the best job. So sometimes the bass doesn't sound like it would be how it would sound if we had the actual bass track that they produce the track with. Does that make sense? So but let's solo let's solo this to see what the bass sounds like. Okay. Yeah it it's it's alright. I can still hear AI does this weird thing where it's also like pulling in some of his vocal. So it's not a complete like separated stem, but it's enough for us to see what's going on in the track, which is cool. It's insightful. Let's check this out. The bass comes in and the color changes. Cool. Beautiful. You can really see this city come to life. Okay, that's cool. Let's see what happens there. I love how it's like the track, the reverb doesn't hang over, and it just, it just, it has a little, a little pause there. Let's see. That. Look at the file. That's cool. You just hear that breath. Let's zoom in. Zoom in. Check out that. There he is. There's Jungkook's vocal. If you want to see what it looks like. <laughs> 
That's cool. That's great. Okay, let's see it with the video. Well, that's really pretty. I gotta check that out. You know you wanna see it too. Uh, let's see, there's so many great things happening in there. I, I still think it's simple. I think it's just uh, the bass, piano, maybe some strings or something. Let's, let's see. Yeah, there's a string part happening right here. Let's see here. It's not the greatest when AI separates it, but uh, still, let's see it all together. This is what this is li without his vocal. Here we go. So that's what's happening there. But let's hear his vocal only. Seems like some harmonies, maybe. Yeah. See, now he's bringing in harmonies. It's really pretty. I'll shut up. I'm talking over it. Let's check. I'll let you listen. It's not the okay, okay. I had it on the loop. Okay, here we go. Let's, let's enjoy the rest of the video. Thanks for diving in and checking that out with me. It's very interesting to me as a producer to, to dive in and see all this. Great shot. Cool. That's a great song. When I first when I first heard that and saw it, like, oh, a song called "Hate You." What is this? Um, man, it's so cool. You get the like I said before. It's if you've had heartbreak, you know that's how you feel sometimes. But there's hope. I got married and uh, I've been married for almost twenty years, and uh, you forget about all those heartbreaks. It doesn't doesn't hurt anymore. It's the best ever. So there's hope. Okay. Anyway. Thank you for going through this. I don't know. Let me know if you think this kind of style of watching videos is interesting, and I'll do it more often. And if there's some videos that I have already reacted to, but you want to see what the stems look like, the audio files, let me know which ones you want to you want me to do, and we'll do a deep dive and kind of look at them together. Okay, well, as always, make sure you like and subscribe, share this video with others, and uh, check out my own BTS cover I did somewhere in the description. And uh, I'll see you next time.